Hi, my name is Pumla Vilagazi. I'm the founder and the CEO of an organization called Sasop's Peace Foundation. We are based in, in Peter Maritzburg. Uh, we focus mainly on economic development of unemployed young women uh, through a program called a uh, Paramisa Girls Economic Empowerment Program. We form them into what we call we call hubs, which means a hand up girl squads. Uh, this has been such a wonderful journey for us as an organization, especially when we got the funding from Gender Links. It re it has really made such a difference in our organization because it was through this funding, our first funding, that we were able to germinate some of the ideas that we had because we couldn't implement some of the ideas that we had but through this funding we were able to implement a program where we create entrepreneurs out of these young women we, we find jobs for them as well as help them with their overall social development we have seen such a change in some of the women. We have beautiful stories to tell and, and we're so proud of what we have achieved. Um, through our partnerships with some of the organizations that we met through Gender Links, we've partnered with organizations like Inema, uh, Dorcas Foundation, Asime Women. You know our relationship with Asime Women has also enhanced our program in that through their leadership program, we were able to uh, assist some of our, about 10 of our young women who went on to then start their businesses. And, and you know, like one of the examples that I would like to highlight is a lady that uh, started with us and then joined Asime and used the stipend from, from, from Asime to, to build in a crash from scratch and so we saw a dream uh, being realized uh, through our program we have young women that came to this program they were so despondent they had lost hope and coming from deep rural areas they just had lost hope and through this program we were able to reach them and they are now business women of notes and they are so confident and one of, the, of our of our ladies was even recognized uh, in her in her um, award by the councillor through their uh, 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 through uh, the award program there and you know it's so amazing to see uh, the work that we're doing having uh, this impact uh, we uh, really appreciate uh, how gender links works with you the thing that i really like about gender links is that they they journey with you through the process they teach you they grow with you and 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 it was very a, 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 a good that the first grant that we got was from an organization like this one because then we were able to learn we attended courses we were we were required uh, through their stringent uh, reporting processes and systems we were required to report which then inculcated the culture of reporting in, in our own organization and you know like we were even able to get other funding because of how this um, funding has positioned us. It, it just demonstrated to other funders that we can be trusted with funding. And you know, one of the, fun, of the funds that we received was about 2.8 million for a, a furniture incubator. And I'm glad to say we are graduating the first a, 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 a incubators from the first cohorts from that funding. And so this could not have happened because if gender links had not been there, we wouldn't have been able to give the funder confidence that we can be trusted uh, with their funding. Uh, we really appreciate uh, what gender links has done to our organizations. We will forever be indebted to gender links for the good work and the impacts that we're having. You know, my respect uh, is 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 neglected most of the time. You don't find many programs in Peter Marisbeck. And so a program like this is really like really does make a change in the communities. And so because our program targets rural areas, urban areas and semi-urban areas, this change is really felt in most of these areas through our intervention. And even as an organization we've grown, 
we are respected even in the circles amongst other CPOs. We are one of the respected organizations, we are visible and uh, with the knowledge that we bring we are even able to share that knowledge with others. Thank you so much.